this. You only need to do this process once because you can just bash through the next time. I'll show you that. Click OK. And then it asks you if you want Mango hard over the top as well. It's great. So when I click that, there is a load of other optimizations it does. And it should do this. And it should fire up Gamescope, he says. Is it going to do it? There we are. So we're into Gamescope, which is like Bao's micro compositor. So bear with me. What we'll do is we'll run both those benchmarks again now in game smoke mode. Now, this is why I think, so first time a minute. Come on, tap, price, tap. Here we are. So let's run them again. Now, I think it won't allow me to run them quite the same, but let's see. Obviously, like you're fully immersed in no visual artifacts. It's literally like being on a Steam Deck. Or it'll be, I'd be interested to see how they modify the OS for when it goes onto a desktop. Let's see what this does now. Synchronizing cloud, okay. Don't need the vault shaders, right. I think this doesn't allow me to do, this is why I switched off DLSS. I think there's certain things it doesn't allow you to do. Well, it's going for it. It used to boot up with that weird window at the beginning, but maybe because I set it in normal Steam, it's just gonna to stick to the settings. Okay, let's have a look at the options and display and graphics. Here we are, oh no, it's got everything, everything stayed the same, great. Everything's the same. So let's run the benchmark in Gamescope.